Don't just have a good day. Have an effective one. Logic over emotion. When I walk my uh, dog this morning, I could, uh, I had already encountered uh, people probably walk up on the wrong side of the bed or the wrong side of the floor. And I think, um, look, I'm, I'm nothing special. I'm not hot shit. I realize that I am just a monkey for a limited time only with a bunch of other monkeys flying on this rock known as Earth throughout space. And uh, attempt to um, expand or enrich, enrich the life experience, or if not, just get out of the way of others. <coughs> and uh, what what bothers me is that I still see again. The look of, um, did you just fart in my cereal? <laughs> kind of look, and merely by saying good morning, merely by existing, merely by making eye contact. You know, in the Marine Corps, while being on the road, doing my road trips, um, I've, I've learned a teensy wincy, wincy bit about um, the dark side of man. There's a reason why uh, violence or death uh, doesn't really uh, bother me a lot. I think a lot less than the usual. But I think as Jocko Willink had put it, it's something like, you know, if you know darkness, if you know pain, if you know hurt, it's good. And uh, why is that? Well, because you know what good is. And why not spread more of that, of that good? And, uh, and this is where people usually fall into their own excuses. Oh, but you see, I don't have time. I got this. I got my job. I got my career. I got to study. I got kids. I got my baby mama. I got my girlfriend doesn't want me to do this. And, uh, and, and other things. And, uh, and to me, I learned it a bit, <laughs> a bit later in life. And, and I lost some, some precious moments. Trademark pending. Not precious moments, the fucking little cartoon, but um. I still uh. went after it, man. And uh, it just gets to me again when people do their impersonation of uh, being. Uh, being stuck in the, um, being, of having the face of being stuck in Auschwitz with the long face and uh, being in the supposed state of complete despair, defeat, limitation, hurt, pain. Because then that spreads. Oh yeah, girl, you don't know, girl, you, you don't trust no man. Yeah, man, all, all women are bitches. You don't trust nobody, no, no, it's all about 
the family, only only us. We we need to make all the money we can and just hoard it. I don't trust anybody else. Oh, how much money can you make off of that? No, no, fuck that, man. Just make make squeeze all the every fucking penny out of it for you. You, 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 you gotta win. And uh, it's the same thing as uh, someone saying, you know what? I'm hungry. I don't want to work for this. Let's go rob someone. And and it's, again, it starts off with a small behavior, man. Stupid behavior that's okay as a kid. That's taught by a parent, a grandparent, a step parent, a teacher. The big brother, the big sister, the neighbor, the uncle, the counselor. And, um, and before you know it, you just got a rotten environment, a weak environment, a victimized, a self-victimizing environment. And, and, and it spreads, man. And, and people will even say, well, you know what? I know what that's like. And to me, I just stay away from it. I'm just going to walk away from it. Uh, no doubt, you just want to stand somewhere and just pick battles and just fight, fight, fight. No. Um, I do walk away from a lot of shit. thinking, hey, I don't want to deal with it. But I'll, I'll say my piece. And I'll be like, eh, well, this is a situation. You're a coward. You're a punk. And I'm walking away. Where there's other people that uh, will hang their heads low. Oh man, hope the boss doesn't see me. Hope they don't see me. Hope the leader does the pack. The supposed leader of the pack doesn't see me. And let me just get on with my way. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, boss. Yeah. Yeah, that was good, that was good. Yeah, man, that was good. Yeah, you go, girl. Mm-hmm, you were right. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And, um... I think it's pathetic, man. Again, we're a uh, civilization species that uh, has created pyramids. That still stand centuries later. Landed a fucking robot on a comet. I forget how fast that fucking comet is moving, but it's fast. And some way, somehow, some of us say, oh no. I don't know if I can read this book and learn or practice or become better at this. I don't know. I don't know. Um, you know, with, that, with other things I'm doing in life. I guess I could really freak out and be like, Oh no, this is never going to get done. I'll never be the best in this. Oh no. I need more money, I need to get this done, oh no. Just be effective. Be effective, man. And, uh, and, I, and I acknowledge my ignorance. I acknowledge my flaws. I know I'm not the type of dude that's gonna say, oh, whoa, one day at a time. <laughs> no. Nope. Not like that.
and also don't mean to just say um let me hope for the best and uh, things will work out let me pray to god and it'll work out nope hell no times in life where I think I've struck out 23 times in a row trying to make a sale of my prints or shirts no thank you nah it's not gonna sell around here it's not what we're looking for or or, or whatever reason right just 23 no's And easily I could have believed, well, that's 23 in a row, and, hmm, they must be right, because 23 in a row, and they all said that, yeah, I should quit. Oh, but I, instead I kept on going, kept on knocking on doors. I'm making sales. No, I didn't have a coach. I didn't have a fucking cheerleader to fucking say, hey, you could do it, guy, come on. Looking good. But it's funny when um, you come back victorious. A couple bucks, a couple hundred clients, a couple stories, and even some inspiring artwork. And I think back to those times so that I can sit down and focus on this and be like, you know what? I know I gotta do all this stuff first, but let me fucking um, hit it right on this part. Again, I just want to see you motherfuckers out there. No, man, it's impossible, man. I can't do that, man. You don't understand, man. I had this, I had that. And, uh, and eventually believe, believing and, and believing that you're a victim and that the, the game is over. Because I believe people will do that to you. They'll speak to you and they don't give you a look or live in a way. Ah, game's over. Ah, whatever. It doesn't matter. You should quit also. It's also game over for you, don't you know? This is the hardest that I've tried. Look what's happened to me. Don't you know? What do you know? Oh, man. Go beyond that, man. Much as possible. No excuses, make it happen, go forward.